Hello and welcome to day 15 of my 31 Days of Horror. I'm Joey Hollywood, and the movie I watched today, or should I say miniseries, was Frankenstein, The True Story. Now, I sort of picked this one on its title alone, and that might be a mistake. You see, I thought it was going to be a more accurate retelling of the story Frankenstein, since many of them kind of take a lot of liberties. However, it takes a lot of liberties as well. One thing I did like about it was... The movie starting off with a guy introducing the film while standing in front of Mary Shelley's tombstone. I thought that was interesting. I thought it was a good way to jumpstart the movie, although I do kind of wish it was more of a wraparound type thing. He literally just introduces the film and then the movie takes off. This version, Frankenstein's monster, starts off as a very good-looking person, but over time becomes very ugly as something to do with electricity making the genetics not work right. I don't know. Th there was a lot of stuff that happened in this that I didn't understand why it was happening. Also, everyone's talking about how ugly the monster is, and he just kind of looks like a normal guy. He doesn't look like a monster till after he's set on fire. Then he just looks like a burn victim. Also, Dr. Frankenstein is one of the least important characters of the movie. He's not the one responsible for the reanimation. Some other doctor is. And Dr. Frankenstein's there to just pick up the slack. And then another doctor is introduced into the movie who's kind of like the bad guy. And he kind of is the main driving force of most of the picture. It was a very weird movie, but I wouldn't say it was bad. It was just, it, it was just an odd interpretation of the Frankenstein story and definitely was not a more accurate interpretation. It took a lot of liberties, more than some of the other ones I've seen, actually. I wouldn't say avoid this one. Uh, it's interesting enough, so if you have three hours available, hey, watch it. As for me, I don't think I'll be watching this one again. It wasn't bad, it just wasn't my cup of tea. Well, thank you for watching, I'm Joey Hollywood, and I'll see you tomorrow in day 16 of my 31 Days of Horror.